Hello and welcome to the birthday gift. This is the Life Path Career Message for Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and North Node. Okay, so this is back by popular demand. A lot of people are requesting me. So, I haven't done these in a while. Let's see what message they have for you, Sagittarius. Well, you know, this same thing happened. The cards flipped for Gemini, and it landed on the Queen of Swords independence here. Uh, I'm not going to take it. It's too much cards. But your independence, you need to learn to have that confidence to do things on your own, to lead. Take a leading role. Not afraid to be, geez, your cards not afraid to be alone and then these cards i'm taking isolation five of pentacles uh there's this need for you to start depending on yourself to be to isolate yourself from things that you're dependent on basically that's not going to help you and then we have friendship we have friendship. Knowing how to work better with people, guys. This is a common card right now. This page of cup. There's this need to be more open, more inviting. Uh, all right, so I see what you all are dealing with. Not knowing exactly what your path should be, how to get there. Closing yourself off. Wow, we have the devil as well. All right. You need to let yourself free. A lot of you are bound to a certain uh, thing. Uh, you may feel stuck at a certain job, a certain profession. Uh, start learning different things. Okay? Uh, be more inviting. Give a little. We have Six of Pentacles here. All right. So this is about giving out. And receiving back what you give out. This is about being open. Not closing yourself off. But at the same time, being comfortable doing things on your own. There's a lot that needs to be released. So that you can get on your path. So that you can be used. There's something they need you for. However, there's blockages. You got to free your mind, number one, Sagittarius. Certain things could keep you um, restrained in a certain belief system, looking at things in a certain way. Hmm. Interesting. All right. Uh, some of you might get agitated very easily. <laughs> uh, that just came in. You might have low tolerance. For certain things, it makes it makes you a little bit intimidating. People don't know when you're going to explode in a sense here. Sag. Hmm. So, uh, you need to kind of, it's a, there's this sense of needing to relax, be more open. Some of you are very standoffish. These are things that has to be released. I'm not even getting anything on what you should be doing. This is just telling me what blockages you have to, uh, release in order to actually even, uh, see the path that you're supposed to be on. So let's clarify each card here. Ten of Cups here. 
All right, whatever situation you're going through uh, at home, your home situation, it's uh, trying to teach you to be more friendly, to be more open, to be more inviting. So whatever you're going through personally at home, just know it's trying to get you to relax a little. Just know that. Uh, mm. You guys have things on your mind. There's things that are you're dealing with. We have the three of cups here. Some of you may drink a lot. Some of you may party a lot. But you do this to get your mind off of something. Uh, you guys are getting a, a reading on what you need to stop in order to get this emotional fulfillment. Certain things you're not seeing clearly. Y'all are dealing with uh, some type of love situation. It's clouding what's going on here. It's blocking you from seeing something clearly. There's um, some kind of communication that's trying to come into you to help you. Actually, the Six of Wands is clarifying the Six of Pentacles to help you get that victory. There's something waiting for you. But what you're going through personally, that's playing a role with getting you on your path. So that needs to be taken care of. There's going to be more specific messages in the Life Path Number readings as to what energies you need to embody to get you on your life path. This is telling me what, what's blocking you. There's this sense of neediness, thinking you need something or someone. There's something you're attached to. There's a way you're looking at things. It's how you do things, how you show up when you interact with people. Uh, but then again, there's a victory. And then not only that, there's earning power here. Six of Pentacles. This lets me know there's earning potential for you. And it's going to actually put you at a um, a good space. Make you feel like a winner. Like you're being received well. Okay? Like people come to you. They see you in the highlight. A lot of you, you're dealing with pride and ego. You're too proud. Y'all got a different kind of reading here, Sagittarius. Because uh, you have things that are stopping you, blocking you from uh, career success. Okay, so uh, the link down below will get you to your life path number reading. If you don't know your life path number, the calculator is also down below. Okay, I really hope this was helpful, guys. I want to thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.